fair use, fair use. I'm just reporting the fraud. Shalom, shalom, peace, peace. You know how when you you assume somebody is a clown, you assume somebody is just a cornball, like just eh, don't stand for nothing, just go with the flow, just try to be grouped in with everybody, try to say all the right things. Just eh, when you assume it, but then you get the confirmation. And you like, hmm. my intuition of a lie. Exhibit A, Charlemagne, the fraud. But uh, yeah, no, don't don't say that though, because he said a lot of he still said a lot of anti-Semitic rhetoric in the in the interview as well. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no, he don't say that though. He still said a lot of anti. Black people, we don't have no power. No matter what we do, we can all click up. We don't have no organization that has holds anyway. And NAACP don't hold no weight. We don't have no organization that holds no weight. You can't speak bad about a Jewish person because they have organizations and they're a close-knit group of people in power who will bring you down. Same thing with gays. You can't say nothing bad about gays because they move as a unit. Black people don't have that. I mean, if you if you do a racist comment about black people, there are repercussions. When you don't, who? Just, you don't just walk away from that. Who? Tell me, give me an example. I mean, you know, Kramer. That's because he was white, and nothing really bad happened to him. You know why nothing bad happened? I never to him? really heard from him again. I think because he got so rich that he was just cool. Like like, like Jews don't go out and try to uh, recruit people into the religion like. You know, certain Christians and, mm-hmm. and Muslims. And stuff. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't even feel comfortable talking about this. I'm sweating right now. I listen, <laughs> I, listen, I, listen, I, listen, I don't. I don't. There's certain things. There's certain things I don't like to talk about. And I love Jewish people, but they're powerful. I don't want them to misconstrue anything I'm saying or take anything I'm saying the wrong way. So I would much rather not even have this conversation. I have a lot of great Jewish people in my corner. I have a Jewish. I have a Jewish conglomerate. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. You know why there's not a lot of Jewish rappers? Because there's Jewish owners and Jewish CEOs. They run these labels. <laughs> They're the bosses. That's why I'm uncomfortable. What, what did Kanye say? He said, uh, happy Kwanzaa to all the artists and... Happy, happy Hanukkah to all the label execs. It's the truth. They run, they run the business.